Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve a new world connection error that you're experiencing on your Windows computer, particularly with connection errors, such as it may say that it's not authorized to continue playing, timed out while waiting for the server to spawn the player, or unable to establish connection with the server. So I'm just going to cover a few different various error message resolutions in this tutorial. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first thing I recommend trying would be to actually just go ahead and make sure there aren't any server problems online. So that would entail opening up a web browser. And I will have a link in the description of the video here, guys, to a server status page that's hosted by New World themselves. And you can check various regions and see if you are experiencing problems in the various regions here. It would actually list it out here. You may have to give us some time to update. There's always a chance there's a little bit of a delay. And if you just started experiencing an issue, it might take a few minutes to actually appear in this list here. So just keep that in mind. So if there's an issue with the servers, nothing I'm going to show you guys in today's tutorial is going to resolve that other than just waiting a few minutes or potentially a couple hours in some cases for the servers to come back. So that's one thing I'd recommend taking a look at. Something else you guys can try here as well would be to open up the search menu and type in CMD. Best match to come back with command prompt. You want to right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive the user account control prompt, select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, type in N-E-T-S-H space Winsock, W-I-N-S-O-C-K space reset. Exactly how you see it on my screen. Hit enter on your keyboard. Should come back with successfully reset the Winsock catalog. You must restart the computer in order to complete the reset. Now you want to type in IP config space forward slash flush DNS. Flush DNS should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard, should come back with Windows IP configuration, successfully flushed the DNS resolver cache. Close out of here and then restart your computer. And then if you attempt to connect to the new world servers, hopefully you should be up and running. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.